Every day, every week, every month and every year, thousands of people across our country campaign for the Conservative Party. They're members of the Conservative Party. They pay money to the Conservative Party. They support the Conservative Party by going to events which sometimes they don't want to go to. But they support the Conservative Party and then they put their bodies where their mouths are by filling up envelopes, writing things and delivering them and supporting local candidates, whether they're members of Parliament or councillors. These are the people that are the Conservative Party and we've got to listen to what they have to say. And if we don't, watch out. I got involved with Conservative Grassroots because I was so dissatisfied with David Cameron's management of the party and the extraordinary things that are happening. Um, the same-sex marriage bill is a clear indicator of that and it's something that caused me to resign from office and from the party. This proposal to redefine marriage is not necessary, it's not wanted and it's not in any manifesto. We have a real problem within the party and the leadership seems to be disconnected with the grassroots. On traditional marriage, 70% of Conservative backbench MPs fell to support the Prime Minister. It's very worrying when the Prime Minister cannot rely on the support of so many backbench MPs. It's urgent requirement that the party reconnects, that the leadership, the backbenchers and members in the country are all united together. And I think the leadership needs to act quickly to solve this problem. As a Conservative Party member of over 20 years, it's the Conservative grassroots that provide the campaigning force, the ideas and the enthusiasm. And we must reconnect before the general election in two years' time. Those of us who are deeply involved in the party that pay our fees, that are on the doors, uh, knocking on doors, handing out leaflets, are kind of dis disenfranchised. And I don't believe that will help the party in the long term at all. And this is why I'm supporting the Conservative grassroots movement. It's extremely important that each local Conservative Party association does reach out to its ground root support. But a feature of modern times is that fewer people are joining political parties. We want to be as welcoming as we possibly can to represent all the views expressed in the Conservative Party. Congratulations to Conservative Grassroots. It's fantastic that this initiative is being launched and I'm fully behind uh, an initiative that brings in and strengthens our grassroots. As a Member of Parliament, I simply wouldn't have got elected if I didn't have the support of grassroots Conservatives helping me where it counts, when it counts. I'm very keen that we should get as many people to sign up to Conservative Grassroots so that your thoughts and comments will be listened to in the future. Politics has changed so much in the last 10 years in Britain. And I think a lot of people are confused as to what their place as citizens of the United Kingdom is in British politics. Conservatives need to make it clear what Conservatives stand for. That's something that we've lost in the Conservative Party. We need to get back. And Conservative Grassroots aims to do just that.